just in Doha Airport right now in my connection back to London Heathrow. After spending two weeks in Australia for um, one week testing and then also on the weekend just passing as the first round of the World Superbike Championship. So we, we had a really difficult time to be honest out there and I um, put together a 4-6 scorecard in, in the races which was which was quite okay to be honest. I was quite happy with that just to start the season as um, as a start, you know, we're much better than last year and also we know we're heading back to Europe now with, with our bikes that you know they're gonna work in Portugal. We've had a good test there but I didn't, I didn't really enjoy the race, especially race two and in the very I think turn four in the first lap I ran onto the gravel and um, by the time I turned the bike on the grass and came back on it was uh, you know ten odd seconds off the lead pack and um, that's that's where I finished in the end. I, I came through to finish sixth so Really, really happy with that, and hopefully uh, we can carry that kind of racing without the mistakes into into Portugal next month. But um, yeah, hopefully when I get over this jet lag and um, when I get home, I'm really excited about my motocross team. It's their first international race of the year at Hawkstone Park. I'm going to go and see that there, and then also um, on Friday I'm doing a workshop day at Trinity College for. Uh, for the Honda School of Dreams, and I'm um, looking forward to going there and seeing all the students there and you know, doing my bit for Honda. They've always got bright ideas when it comes to you know, installing that and young people, so i um, looking forward to going and seeing that. And then, basically, also Wednesday, when I get home Tuesday afternoon, Wednesday, um, Tarsh is coming to see me, and also I'll come and see my trainer as well in the afternoon and get back on with that. I'm really, really uh, thank Ian because uh, he's done such a good job in the off season. You know, I felt really good in both races and hence, you know, coming from the back, I never gave up, never felt any fatigue in my body and, you know, really good programme we were on in the winter time. And, yeah, roll on to Portugal, I can't wait for that and hopefully I can keep it interesting for, for all you guys as well and get back to where we belong on the, on the top step of the podium.